All right, the field is green. So before we start this match, we know our Red Alliance is at the advantage. Blue fighting to stay alive. Let's hear it if you are rooting for your Red Alliance. And let's hear it if you are rooting for our Blue Alliance. All right, we will see how this match unfolds. Drivers behind the line. Three, two, one, power up. And our robots are off. We have 4265 successful in their scale auto. This is when it counts, ladies and gentlemen. But 1018 is doing the same, also placing a cube on the scale for the Red Alliance. This is a preview of the six incredible robots we have on the field right now. They all want it real bad. It's been a long day of incredible matches and these two alliances both want to come out on top. 868 is successful in placing a cube on the scale for the Blue Alliance. They're also picking up the Wild Bots droppage and also placing that on it as well. However, Pike and Control Z are not to be outdone and they have each also placed two cubes on the scale for the Red Alliance. 4265 also placing a cube for Blue. 1792 round table robotics working and successful on capturing possession of the switch for, for of the blue switch for the red alliance while their partners are battling over the scale in the middle additionally we have cyber cards working diligently to place cube after cube in the exchange for the blue alliance 1792, however, is making quick work of the human player station and other cubes on the field for their heavy offense on the Blue Alliance's switch. We have just under a minute left in this match. Not a lot of time for the Blue, for the Red Alliance to make up this deficit. The Blue Alliance has control of the scale. Red Alliance is doing a three robot job to get cube after cube on the scale. Unfortunately, their aim is a little off. We have 35 seconds left in the match, and it is imperative for these robots to be on their A game. 30 seconds left, it is now time for the end game. 4265 is lining up to climb. They did it last